Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, Microsoft has unfortunately once again confirmed yet another known issue over on its known issues health dashboard page, which apparently started once again with the August Patch Tuesday security update for Windows 11 24H2 KB5063878. And man, that update has caused numerous issues, as I have been letting you know on the channel. And that would also apply to Windows 11 across the board. So that would be Windows 11 23H2 and also Windows 10 across the board. And most versions of Windows Server with the relevant updates that rolled out for Patch Tuesday in August for those different editions and versions of Windows. Now basically what's happening is the August 2025 security update and later updates has introduced a security change that affects how user account control, also known as UAC prompts behave during Windows installer MSR repair operations. And basically what is happening with uh, the said updates is they are enforcing a requirement for administrator credentials whenever MSR repair or related tasks are run to address a security vulnerability listed as CVE 20255073. With Microsoft saying, and as a result, after installing those updates, those UAC prompts for administrator rights can appear for standard users in the following scenarios. So if we just head over to the health dashboard with this announcement. So here are the following scenarios. Running MSR repair commands such as the following. Launching Autodesk applications, including some versions of AutoCAD, Civil 3D, and InventorCam when installing an MSR file after a user signs into the app for the first time. Installing apps that configure themselves per user. Running Windows Installer during active setup. Deploying packages via Manager Configuration Manager that rely on user-specific advertising configurations and the last one enabling secure desktop. Now Microsoft carries on to say that if a standard user runs an app that initiates an MSI repair operation without displaying the UR, it will fail with an error message. So as an example, installing and running Office Professional plus 2010 as a standard user will fail with error 1730 during the configuration process. Now, Microsoft has given us a workaround. And it's actually a very simple workaround if you are experiencing this issue. Microsoft says, when possible, run the app as administrator. That would be from the start menu or search results. Right-click the app and select run as administrator. So as an example, if we head into our start, all apps, and I just find an app. Let's look at paint. You right-click the app, head to more, and run it as admin. You'll have to do that manually until obviously a workaround is released and microsoft says the next steps is it's working to address this issue by allowing it administrators to permit specific apps to perform msr repair operations without uac prompts this improvement microsoft says will be released in a future windows update and will and it will provide more information when it is available and obviously when i get wind of that i'll try and post and let you guys know so there we have it another known issue which seems to be affecting Windows across the board. And just on a side note, I think this issue is more going to be experienced in an enterprise environment more than a home environment, but just keeping you guys posted. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.